I'm Keith Peters with the Palo Alto Weekly. With me is Alex Gil Fernandez, a junior on the gun basketball team. Last week at the Panther Invitational at Prospect High School, Alex played in three games. Gun won all three. He scored a total of 62 points. He had 28 points in the opener, 14 points in the championship game as Gun defeated host Prospect. He was named the tournament's most valuable player. And for that performance, he is the Palo Alto Weekly Boys Athlete of the Week. Uh, you guys are off to a 6-1 start. You went 3-0 last week. Obviously a great uh, momentum builder for your team. Yeah, I thought we played great defense. We hustled, boxed out, and uh, our coach really emphasized defense. Last year that was our problem, but uh, this year I think we really stepped it up on the defensive end. When you open a tournament and you score 28 points, what does that do for the rest of the tournament? Did that sort of give you that uh, uh, confidence that uh, you could take it to the other teams? Yeah, definitely. I got a lot of confidence from that. I had my swagger back. Uh, in the early games this year, I didn't play too well. So this was really important to me. It was a confident builder. And winning a, a tournament title, uh, what is that going to do for you guys going into uh, the new year? Well, we won a, the Los Gatos tournament last year. So, you know, we're going to – last year we didn't start too well after the tournament. We won the tournament. So we're just going to keep it up. We just look forward to keeping it up. And uh, job ain't done. What would you say uh, you like about this year's team? Is, is it much different from last year? What's, uh, what's this team all about? I think we have more experience this year. I think we had three sophomores last year. And so the winning, everyone winning was kind of new to us. But this year, you know, we're experienced. And I think Chris Russell has really took the leadership role. He did a lot of the scoring last year. Did you feel that uh, you were like sort of a secondary role and you guys are still back uh, sort of like a one-two punch again this year? Oh, yeah. I think we definitely are complementary to each other. Uh, we both, I drive, kick out to him. So I think we, we work well together as a team. Your coach, Brandon Williams, uh, actually is a Pally grad. It's, it's kind of ironic, uh, him coaching that gun, but uh, I guess you respect him and you don't really worry that uh, what high school he went to. Oh, not at all. He really wants to be Pally this year, especially at Pally. So I'm looking forward to that game. Winning for him, too. What would you say the important, what you guys need to do to, to be successful this year that you weren't doing last year? Defense, defense, defense. I think we gave up 100 points to one game last year, so it's definitely defense. Boxing out as well. So beating Pally uh, once or twice, uh, that's, that's going to be the, uh, a big goal, and I guess getting to the, the postseason playoffs as well. Yeah, that's probably our biggest goal, winning CCS. And uh, beating Pally, and it's up there. They're not in our league, but that's a big, and winning league. It's probably important to us, too. Good luck the rest of the way. Congratulations. Thank you.